It was a roach, y'all. A roach. Good morning, y'all. It's super early, like 6.30 in the morning. We are headed to the gym. As you know, I train with PhD Fitness, aka Bo, and I usually go to the gym at 7 a.m. So we are headed to Workout Junkies to get a workout in this morning because as I have been saying in every vlog, your girl got to lose some weight. The snowstorm put me behind because I was eating snacks and I didn't work out the whole week. So I didn't lose no weight last week, but this week I better drop at least three pounds by Friday or we gonna have some problems. I don't know, sometimes I think it's my birth control at the same time. So I be like, let me let me quit taking that. But I can't quit taking that because I need that for so many reasons. But yeah, we're going to the gym guys. So I will see y'all in just a little bit. Are you gonna be, say that you're gonna be. What I did last night I came home Say around a quarter to three Still so high Hypnotized In a trance From this body So buttery brown And tantalizing You would have thought I needed help From this feeling that I felt So shook I had to catch my breath Um, I just got my oil changed, dropped my car off, went to go edit a video, you know, like being productive and things. It's time for me to pick up my car and they're like, baby girl. Okay. Let's see. They're like, girl, you know you got an oil leak? And I'm like, mm. no. They're like, yeah, you have a massive oil leak. And see, I just be feeling like people be trying to take my money, so I be like, mm, do I? So they was like, yeah, you have massive oil leak, da 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 And then they start saying stuff, and when they start talking, I stop listening because I don't even know what you're talking about. And, you know, that's why I give glory to God, because I have a father. You know, I'm so grateful that he is still here, because as soon as they start talking problem that was outside of the oil change, mm, I can't help y'all. 
y'all can't help me at this point. Let me call my dad and see what he say because if he don't say get it fixed, I ain't getting it fixed. Because for one, if it costs too much, I'm not getting it fixed. Two, uh, if I gotta get it fixed and it costs too much, well, we got to pray about it. But they said it was a massive oil leak. That's really all I know. Then my daddy was asking me, well, what is it? What was what's the oil leak? What kind? A oil leak? I don't know. It's an oil leak, daddy. That's what they said on the paper. So I had to read the paper to him, and it made sense to him. It didn't make sense to me, but you know, it's like the devil is always busy. I'm over here hustling and grinding, trying to do stuff to better myself. And here he come messing up the frequency and the flow of my finances. But it's okay because one thing I do know about God is he always provides and things always work out. So I'm not going to worry about it in that. But that just kind of just irritated me more than it probably should have. But it definitely did. Um, I think I was more irritated because I don't know what's going on. Like, the man was really talking to me. And I'm just like, okay, now what's wrong? And he kept saying the same thing. I'm, okay, sir. Because you don't want me to know what's going on in my car. Because you're not making sense. You're not, break, you're not breaking it down. So I just ate some food because I realized when I get angry, cranky, in a mood, I'm typically hungry. So I just got some food. It's a thousand degrees outside. I don't understand. And I'm hot. I have on two sweatshirts, mind you. Actually, I'm going to take one of them off because I'm hot. But, um, I just ate some of my meal prep. I had some salmon, wild rice, and mixed veggies. But I'm headed to Edmund Nutrition. They are my favorite. Shout out to them. If you ever in Edmund, go to Edmund Nutrition off a of second, right across from the Target. They hook you up. Tell them I sent you. I'm about to go get me a tea because I need some energy because I was getting real sleepy while I was editing that video and I was like, woo. And I'm about to start lashing, so I need some boost. So I'm about to get a tea. So yeah. Okay guys, we're at Edmund Nutrition. What's up? <laughs> and they have some really cute specials for Valentine's. Yes, we do. You wanna tell them right? Sure, <laughs> so um, we actually do a new menu every single month. Just, um, we have a base menu, but we do like a little special one every month. So this month it's February, so of course we did a Valentine's theme. Um, we have a sweetheart tea, a cherry bomb tea, and a wild thing tea. Um, they burn calories, give you energy, they're super delicious, and they're sugar free, um, which is what she just got. Um, mm -hmm. And then we have shakes, the red velvet Oreo is fire. Here in Edmond, that's our top seller right now. And then we also do protein waffles and stuff like that. And it's all, everything is like red and pink this much, this Cute. month, which is really awesome. So, yeah. All right. Y'all be sure to come. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, girls. Hey. So it's later. I've done my first two clients already this morning. So I got like a, what time is it? 1230. I got like an hour and a half break. And within this hour and a half break, I'm about to go grab some lunch at Chipotle. Mind you, last night I went to, oh, shit. Okay. Last night, I went to Qdoba because Qdoba is my spot. Like, when it comes to a bowl, I'ma have it there. My issue with Qdoba was when I got there, it was probably like 9.45, so very close to closing. But my issue was that it was a roach, y'all. A roach on the glass. You know, when you stand in front of the glass to order, it was a roach. I said, oh my God, it's a roach. And they was just looking at me like, that's not okay. So I left. Mind you, Qdoba is right behind my apartment. So it's so easy to grab Qdoba. And I like Qdoba over Chipotle. Chipotle I haven't had in like maybe two or three years. I've only ate it one time and I didn't like it. But my client was like, you should try it again. It's really the same thing. Like it's not any difference. So I'm gonna try it, and if it's not good, I'm gonna be quite annoyed. But, you know, what can you do? I really gotta get something for this camera so it can start, so it can sit better. Whoa, let's focus, there we go. Um, But yeah, so I'm about to go to Qdoba, or Chipotle, grab some lunch. I have, um, I have a wax appointment at European at one. 
and then I'm a like literally everything is right by my house so like Qdoba Chipotle whatever it's called Chipotle is right up here up the street then I have to go back this way but going this direction literally like across the street from my apartment is European that I go to get my wax come back home have like 30 minutes to just kind of breathe woo before my next client and then I have three more clients to knock out and I should be done working around 7 30 maybe even before because everybody else today after my two o'clock is a feel so let's just pray it stays pretty neutral pretty easy it's Friday um yeah so yeah I'll see y'all after I get this food I'm gonna try it on camera so I can see if it's me that if I don't really like it or if I was tripping so we'll see okay I'm back but when I get food and I'm hungry the biggest inconvenience to me is if you mess my order up because most of the time I'm rushing which is not anyone's fault but mine but I'm rushing and then I have to come back like it's just very aggravating so but that didn't it wasn't too bad he immediately gave me my chips but this is my bowl very simple not much um too much going on and that's ghetto they charge extra for cheese that's very ghetto I do not like that for me Okay, let's see. They charge extra for everything. Guacamole cheese, like Q-Double would never. But them motherfuckers had roaches, so. Here we are. And not only did they charge extra for queso, it's like a dollar and some change. It ain't even like 50 cent. That's ghetto. It's not as, it's not bad. But the rice is not done. It's good and crunchy. And it's not as flavorful, but it's not bad. Like it'll do it'll do the job, but it definitely is not as flavorful as Qdoba. Okay y'all, it is Saturday. So I'm going to start the weekend vlog. I don't know if I'm going to let this be the start of it or what. I'm trying to figure all of that out. But I wanted to show y'all my order. The things I picked up this week. So Fashion Nova, of course. I did a, a one-day shipping and the shit actually came in. I need it for this weekend, mind you. I'm hoping that it fits because your girl is gonna be SOL if they don't. Those are some jeans. They jeans is, is BOGO right now. Buy one, get one. But I got these jeans in particular because they are giving cute in Valentine. Look at this. They have a heart detail on the booty. Ain't that cute? And they a little flare situation. So I figure I wear these on Valentine's Day or something. But for sake of dinner tonight, let me see. I ordered, I forgot what it is. This is a red, like faux leather dress. And I'm gonna see what this is given when I put it on. Um, but I don't think I'm gonna wear this tonight. I think I'm gonna save this for a different occasion. But I also ordered um, like a silky pink, baby like baby pink dress. So. This is what this looks like. I need to try it on, honestly. I just do not feel like it. But I'm going to have to because I got a pack. I'm going to Dallas tonight. 
with my girls to have dinner in Dallas. So, if I don't try it on right now, I don't want to just pack it and then I can't fit it and be looking crazy. So, being that, I've been telling y'all, I've gained some weight. So, I ordered a large. And Lord knows, I didn't want to, but I ain't trying to look crazy either. But I'm really big on um, getting things altered. So, I was like, well... I can always get it altered, booty woo. Hello, y'all. Welcome back to another vlog. This is a weekend vlog, and we are in Dallas. Excuse how I look. I say that in a lot of videos, but I'm going to transform here soon because we are having a Galentine's dinner, and all the girls and all the boys are going to get real cute. As you can see here, my son is here meeting his brother. <laughs> they, don't, they don't know how to act. Say hi to the boys. Say hi, baby. <laughs> but yes, so welcome to another weekend vlog. Um, we're about to get it started. Sharice, do you have something you want to tell the people? Hey. <laughs> and Yari is always, she looks so beautiful. We love that. We love that. Sharice got her. Okay. And I just want to say that my hair has finally got long enough to get some braids. Okay. And she got a full head, not the shaved sides. Did I hear that the Not the shape. Just realize what you said. Yes, full head. Full head, honey. Who ain't got no issues? Who? Who? Who ain't got no Who got it? Not me? <laughs> Not me or my mother. <laughs> All right, y'all. Well, I will see y'all once we get dressed. We're about to chill for a little bit. Literally, your dog is going to drive me insane. Why do he keep putting his face on my boob? It smells like something he likes. I really don't know why he's crying either. Honestly. Why is he not going to you? He's mad. He don't even know me. I'm about to do a Hold on. He only does it with you. It's private fun. Eleanor, look at you, girl. Look at that man, man in. If he wanted to, he would, baby. And these niggas, and these niggas don't want to. <laughs> like never. If he wanted to, he would really apply because sometimes they want to, but they can't. Why? Because they don't have the money? Yeah. But they, they can, can show some effort, even they if. They can. But, like, for instance, I was listening to this girl TikTok, and she was talking about how she had a handle date, but she canceled at the last minute. And she was like, Well, I don't know what to do. Like, she had to cancel at the last minute because on her profile, she had put that she liked fine dining and, you know, whatever, whatever. And he invited her out, but it just. They were in Chicago and she wasn't from there. She had been there for two years. So he's like, let me take you somewhere. You know, show you the city, like in a different perspective. And she's like, okay. But he he told her he want to take her to like a sports bar type of thing. And she said no. She canceled on him because she was like, no, I don't want to do that. But it's like, maybe that's the best thing he can do. Maybe yeah, now at that, that, he's actually trying. You just don't Are want what he's offering. No, not right now. You just don't want what he's offering. That's yeah. different. I'm talking about, like, if he wanted to, he would. So he's doing what he can do. Yeah, that's, that's for sure. Like, of course. But she may know she want a rich nigga. <laughs> She's a material girl. Yeah, she said they don't serve salmon and broccoli here, so I can't. They probably did, though. Ooh, okay. 
Like Enjoy, yeah. Enjoy. She got to get after the lunch. I ain't never been hungry after I had sex. Like, hungry and laying in the bed. You don't have to be like, I want to have a sandwich after sex. No. I ain't never said that. Who the fuck says that? People. Who's people? They say that me. I thought people just come to sleep. Yes. Okay. If it's good. If it's good, I'm going to bed. Going straight to sleep. Unless it's a quick making sandwich. Now I might get some water because my mouth be dry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That bitch came back the next day after that game. Boy, she was so easy. Hi. Baby's back. I was telling uh, Desi that she reminds me of Okay, y'all. So I got my package from Danny yeah. Days. Post the video unboxing you your story and tag us. Hello, beautiful. Super cute. Let's get into this. Super cute scrunchy. Okay. Hello, beautiful. Enjoy 10% of your next purchase. Shout out to the girls starting their businesses. Okay, this is the necklace. I know this is the 14 inch. I don't remember what it's called. I will tag it. Ooh. That was hard, but surprisingly pretty great. I'm not gonna lie. Even though it did get kind of weird doing your solo routine. What was weird? Working on that move for weeks. All you were looking at was some hard work and determination. Okay. 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 Let's give him material girl, rich girl, on a budget. And I like that for me. You're stepping on my foot and I can't move. This is the bracelet. Or it could be an anklet as well. Anthony had mentioned Paddington too, so I had to see what all the fuss was about, and that damn bear played a tune on my heartstrings. It's an emotional masterpiece. Okay, but why was it? Well, big for my wrist. This may have to be an anklet for the bro. I just remember you saying we were being ridiculous. That was before Sherm saw my big juicy duck. Was it just like the bracelet looks like? Okay, whatever. It's giving rich girl on a budget, and I like that because she is not rich yet, but she is on her way. Yari on your way? Mm hmm. Yes, Yari is on her way to being a rich girl. Mm hmm. At least a rich wife, one or the other. A rich See, wife is a rich girl. <laughs> a rich wife is a rich girl. So this is way too big for my wrist. I got the medium large in the bracelet. Mm, so gonna put this on my ankle because it's giving. I'm not gonna be able to do nothing with this on my wrist. It's gonna fall off. And clearly, you need more self care because we've broken this sappy cycle. Let's see if it can fit on my big ankle. White, Anthony. Sherman. Okay. Yeah, that was good. We don't want to talk. 
about it. I saw a white <laughs> naked front. What? Thank you. Wet close from the tears. <laughs> this is the outfit. Okay, be nice. I was just bragging on y'all. Really weird all the time. You want grown ass children. You know what? I think he's right. For being immature. We can't be adults about this. We need to make Sherman cry. Um, don't you see our okay. dynamic as friends is hanging off a cliff by two? So things. this is the necklace. That's right. You see our emotional genitalia. Now it's time we see his. Sorry, fellas, but I didn't cry. Even when I was born, the doctors thought I was good. The ankle. It was too big for a bracelet. So now I want to order this small. Oh, we'll see. Because I'm still within a 48-hour rental period of a pretty good one. This small bracelet. So I can give what needs to be gave all the way around. But anyway, we're getting ready to go to dinner. Not ready. We're going to be late. If we don't hurry up. We're not going to be late. Technically, we're going to have to move to 9.40. But I just got to put on my dress. Yari has to put on her wig and the rest of her face. Yeah, guys. But I'm going to tell you, it's going to be like, three, two, one. <laughs>
every second, every minute, man, I swear. Every second, every minute, man, I swear. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high, hands up high. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it, man, I swear that she can get it, man, I swear that she can.